buy all versus ad guard which one is better so if you're serious about blocking ads trackers and improving your network privacy you have probably heard of buy all and ad guard home both are great tools for dns level blocking but which one actually gives you better performance easier setup and more control well let's compare them both to figure out starting off with interface and setup so starting with buy all now so it's been around longer and was built primarily for Linux. You'll usually install it on a Raspberry Pi or inside a Docker container. The setup requires a bit of command line work, but once it's done, it's rock solid. The web interface is simple, but outdated compared to Edgard's. Edgard Home, on the other hand, has a modern clean interface and an easier installation process. It can run on Windows, Mac OS, Linux, Docker, or even directly on your router if supported. You can configure it fully through the web dashboard, no terminal required. So if you want a plug and play experience, Edgard wins. But if you enjoy tinkering and prefer minimalism, by whole feels right at home. Now when it comes to features, Edgard Home falls ahead. It supports custom filtering rules, parental control, encrypted DNS protocols like DNS over HTTPS, or DNS over TLS, and even user-specific filters if you run multiple devices. And Pi-hole focuses on simplicity, it blocks ads uh, and trackers using a DNS-based filtering. Uh, it's reliable, but lacks built-in support for encrypted DNS out of the box. You'll need to configure uh, DOH or DOT manually. So for feature-rich, all-in-one solution, Edgard Home clearly takes the lead. Uh, Performance-wise, both Pi-hole and Edgard Home are lightweight, but Pi-hole is slightly more efficient, especially on low-power devices like uh, Raspberry Pi, Zero, or older PCs. It uses fewer resources since it's focused solely on DNS filtering. Edgard Home uses a bit more memory, mainly due to its advanced UI and extra filtering layers. In real-world use, both perform almost identically, in uh, blocking speed and DNS resolution time. So Pi-hole wins for pure efficiency, while AdGuard uh, minor overhead gives you more convenience and control. Now, in terms of community, Pi-hole has a large, dedicated, open source uh, community with plenty of block lists, troubleshooting guides, and active forums. It's completely free and uh, community-driven, uh, Edgard Home uh, is also open source, but uh, it's maintained by the same company that develops the Edgard commercial apps. Uh, that means you get faster updates and more official support. It also feels slightly more centralized. So if you prefer community transparency, go with Pi-hole. If you want reliable updates and professional polish, Edgard is the safer choice. All right now, so which one should you choose? Let's discuss. So choose Pi-hole if you value lightweight performance, simplicity, and community-driven software. It's perfect for enthusiasts who like hands-on control. And choose Edgard Home if you want a modern interface, uh, built-in encrypted DNS, parental controls, and detailed analytics, all with easier configuration. In the end, both do a great job at blocking ads network-wide. The right choice depends on how much customization and convenience you want. So, both Pi-hole and Edgard Home can make your browsing cleaner, faster, and more private. If you're new to DNS blocking, start with Edgard, but if you're experienced and want a minimal open source approach, Pi-hole remains a top choice. Thanks for watching, guys. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out more privacy and tech videos on our channel.